Hello everyone. This is my book, Traditional Medicinal Herbal Formulas Made Easy. So this book will help you study herbal formulas in more authentic ways. Today we will talk about two formulas. First, Urshantang, Urshantang, and second, Da Bu In Wan, Da Bu In Wan. Urshantang means to immortal to undying decoction. So this formula is related to geriatrics, so getting old. And second formula, da bu in wan, da means great, and bu means tonifies, in means in, in and yang, in. So this is the formula tonifies in. And both of the formula have huang bai and ji mu. Those are very important composition in those two formulas. First, let's review the herbs inside. So Jimu and Huang Bai. And this Huang Bai is actually classified as a herb clear damp heat, but when this Huang Bai combined with Jimu, Jimu clears heat and this one clear damp heat, but Jimu Huang Bai clear empty heat. So this is a very commonly used paired herb. So Jimu Huang Bai clears what? Empty heat. Please remember that. So Jimu and Huang Bai. This is Huang Bai and this is Jimu. Jimu Huang Bai as a paired herb, they clear empty heat. Da Bu Yin Huang and Urshan Tang, both of them has Jimu and Huang Bai as a main ingredient. Urshan Tang also has Dang Gui. So Dang Gui Tonifies blood and in. And Jimu Huang Bai clears heat induced by empty heat. Jimu Huang Bai, Jimu and Huang Bai clears empty heat induced by in deficiency and blood deficiency. So this one treat root and this treat branches. So this formula is about those in deficiency, empty heat. And also this formula has three herbs. First, Baji Tian, Baji Tian, and second, Yin Yang Hu, and third, Xian Mao. Yin Yang Hu is very commonly and widely used herb for sexual dysfunction. And Yin Yang Hu, this name actually literally means horny. Yeah, I said right, horny goat, weed. Hu means weed and plant, and Yin Yang means horny goat. So they believe that this herb, specific herb, can increase your sexual libido. And Xian Mao tonifies kidney. So it is also used to increase your sexual libido. And this one, Baji Tian, literally means it penetrates the sky. Which one penetrates the sky? Your urination penetrates the sky. So this is also herb which increase the sexual libido. So tonify kidney yang, tonify kidney yang, and also tonifies kidney yang. So all these herbs, tonifies kidney yang, improve your sexual functions. So three herbs here. So these three herbs, tonifies yang, baji tian, yin yang huo, and xian mao. These tonifies yang, and this side, Tonifies blood and in, and also clear empty it. So this side is three herbs warms. So there's a fire, so warms, and this side clears heat with water. So water and fire are combined in a single formula. Why does that happen? Because when you get old and when you around the menopausal period, people complain about this side of problem, hot flashes, empty heat, and that symptom usually induced by blood deficiency and indeficiency. And also they lose this kind of kidney yang. They also suffered from kidney yang deficiency, losing sexual functions. So these two yin and yang side of problem happens around your menopausal period. And these three herbs are 
especially used for women's sexual dysfunction. So when do you use this formula? When the patient have hot flashes and blood deficiency and sexual dysfunction. Usually many students feel uncomfortable combining these two sides of contradictory herbs because this side clears heat and this side increases tonifies yang. But this is the mystery of herbal medicine. Herbal medicine usually combined with many contradictory herbs inside. And they work like a perfect teammate. So this is urshan tang, two immortal decoction. And next one also include jimu huangbai. So we can see this formula also treat anti heat, but without this side, so it doesn't have to be kidney yang deficiency. But this one has su di huang and gui ban. This is gui ban. So two side, Gui Pan and Su Di Wang. This side clear empty heat and Su Di Wang tonifies in. So it works like Su Di Wang works like Dangui in Urshan Tang. It treat the root. And Gui Pan, this one nourish kidney in and blood. So just like Su Di Wang, Gui Pan nourish in and blood. So this side treat root. And this side treat empty heat induced by in deficiency. So this formula clear empty heat. Gui Pan is a total shell, but inner side shell. And there are similar herb, which is called Biejia. Biejia is outer shell, upper shell, and this is inner shell. Both of them treat kidney in deficiency. So they nourish in. So Su Di Wang, Bui Ban, and Ji Mu Wang Bai. So this is a composition of Da Bu In Wan. Great tonify in decoction. So this side, Su Di Wang, Bui Ban, Da Bu In Wan. And if you add Dang Gui here, and add three herbs, which tonifies kidney yang, this side means Er Shen Tang. Er means two. This side, Er Shen Tang. Er means two, Xian Tang. This is Er Xian Tang. And this side, Ji Mu Huang Bai, Su Di Wang Gui Pan. Da means great, big. Bu means tonify in one. So both of them treat empty fire. And both of them nourish in and blood, Su Di Wang, Gui Pan, and Dang Gui. But only Urshan Tang tonifies kidney yang. And this one, keyword, is menopausal symptoms and hot flashes. And this side, antifire is the keyword. Okay, please remember two important formula, nourish in and clear empty heat, Urshan Tang and Da Bu Hin Wan. Thank you very much. See you later. So we just learned two formulas which has Huang Bai and Ji Mu in common. So they clears empty heat. And one formula which is called Er Shen Tang. Er Shen Tang has Dang Gui. And In Yang Huo, Xian Mo, and Ba Ji Tian. So Dang Gui tonifies blood and In Yang Hu and Xia Mao and Ba Ji Tian tonifies kidney. And the keyword for this formula is menopausal symptoms with hot flashes. And second formula, which is called Da Bu In Huan, has Su Di Wang and Gui Ban. And both of them nourish kidney in. So both formula treat anti heat, but this formula, urgent tongue, treat menopausal symptoms and the symptoms related to sexual dysfunction. And this formula, Dabu in one, is more focused on clearing heat.
empty heat induced by kidney deficiency. Okay, these are the important formula in nourish in category. Okay, and I hope you enjoy this lecture. See you again.